Welcome back students. Hope you all are waiting for the much awaiting important questions for the course Computer Organization and Architecture, I mean COA under JNTUH for R18 Regulation for Computer Science Engineering students. I have also posted important questions of ADE, DS, COSM and OOPS using C++ which are being posted in this channel as well as they are available in a separate playlist. Under the playlist I have uploaded the name CSC21 important questions questions under j 2 hr 18 please go through the playlist and work out all the semester important questions and the concepts the first and foremost gunshot question i can give you for the unit one is a four bit arithmetic circuit to perform full address certain arithmetic operations to be performed for the given values dear students define control gates and the difference between the computer organization as well as computer architecture or computer design versus computer architecture may be also one of the short question the life cycle of instruction and the bus system for four register with multiplexer is said to be the topmost question which may occur in 2a this time and the 4 bit arithmetic operation may be the b question dear students computer register and its types may be the short question register transfer may be also short questions dear students please do work out all the concepts in detail so that you could able to work out even the short questions there are no separate short questions for the course you are supposed to perfectly work out in depth all the concepts so that you could able to work out even the short questions micro operation of arithmetic shift along with the um, uh, certain problems and the 4 bit added and subtracted design is said to be the topmost question which may occur in 3a this time as i hope you know that it consists of part a part b the part b question starts from 2 or 3 2 or 3 instruction codes and direct and indirect address instructions is said to be the topmost question which may occur this time in the question paper 4 bit combinational circuit decrement functional unit of a digital computer input output interrupt may be the short question block diagram of a digital computer and the purpose of each part from this part we can expect 3a 3b in the question paper this time do not expect direct 10 mark question it is a combination and split of 5 5 mark hope you are going to work out if you are working for any unit you are supposed to be thorough with the complete unit it's because it is an or option here in between two questions you are supposed to attempt either 2a b 100 percent or 3a b only dear students next i am going to work out for the fourth question addressing modes along with the example is set with the topmost question microprogram sequence for a control memory along with its diagram is also said to be one of the very very important question input map input program input output explain these questions may be under 4a 4b this time in the question paper stack organization memory map input output hardwired versus microprogram control is said to be the topmost question and the difference need of memory stack and the stack limits is also very very important in form of short and long question that may occur in the question paper in terms of 5a as well as b dear students hope you are going to like my videos if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe and do not forget to share this with your friends too next i am going to work out for you all sixth and the seventh question multiplication and booth algorithm is said to be the topmost question this time that may come in 6a define the term data transfer i triple standards for floating point representation will be the short question sd ram versus d ram bunisz BSA, LDA, STA and their instructions explain them in the short question form flow chart for floating point addition and subtraction operation may be the seven equation logic and program control instructions along with the example fixed point versus floating point with risk representation may be the b question this time addition and subtraction algorithm is also said to be one of the very important question without skipping a single point wherever i'm highlighting you are supposed to work out you are going to score better marks and the percentage plays a vital role in your btech too dear students one day batting may not give you the uh, may give you the uh, marks but not the knowledge please do work out from now data transfer and the modes of dma is said to be the important question and input in input output interface is said to be the topmost question which i have posted on the top are said to be the repeatedly asked and the topmost question cache memory mapping techniques and the main memory may be the short question main versus auxiliary memory and the memory hierarchy is also said to be the topmost question stroke control method using uh, for arithmetic operator asynchronous database daisy chain priority interrupt may 
be the B equation this time. This all may occur in 8A, 8B. Asynchronous data transfer, associative memory hardware organization is said to be the topmost question which may occur in 9A this time. Hardware shaking outline its concepts along with the diagram is said to be the topmost and gunshot question which may occur in 9B. Data transfers and the parallel and single may be the short question. Virtual memory organization is a short question and the computer uh, uh, central computer versus peripherals explain in detail and the difference may be also sometimes asked from the unit 4. Dear students do not just read the concepts in bits and pieces you should be thorough with the complete unit then only you will be going to get 15 mark out of 15 from this. It is because you will be getting two short questions one is of 2 and 3 mark combination and one is a long question which is of 5 5 mark combination. If you are thorough with any unit you are going to cover 15 marks so that I am going to let you know now the fifth unit very important questions pipelining arithmetic and instructions as well as cache coherence problem and four segment pipeline the vector operations and multi process versus inter process communication these questions may occur in the question paper in 10 8 10b as well as in form of short questions arithmetic pipelining diagram along with it is said to be the topmost question which may occur in 11a cise and ris characteristics is also said to be the topmost question and the short questions sometime they may be asking individual vector versus parallel processing a space time diagrams for a four segmented pipeline may occur in 11b. Dear students, you need to work out the operations related to the arithmetic operation programs as well as the diagrams very neatly and the differences. How to write a theory paper is uploaded in this channel. Please go through it and work out accordingly. Hope you have working out all the important concepts and the questions by following my channel. If you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe by pressing a bell icon. You are going to receive the latest notifications on the chat of the videos which I am going to post in this channel. Please do support my channel by giving a thumbs up to this video as well as sharing this content with your friends. If you are looking for any other course content, please do not forget to comment and subscribe to my channel. Good luck and God bless you all dear students. Thank you.